If you're anything like me and work 12 hour plus days, the last thing you wanna do when you get home is spend a boatload of time cooking up a meal. So what you need is a very easy recipe that you can smash together in the littlest amount of time. Meatballs! We're gonna be cooking you some meatballs! All right, as I said today, we are cooking meatballs. And this is as simple as it can get, guys, seriously. Ingredients, two pounds of extra lean ground beef, black pepper, and Himalayan salt, get it in you. We got three garlic cloves, some chives we're gonna smash up, we got some basil we're gonna smash up, I'm gonna smash some sun-dried tomatoes in there, little bit of coconut oil, and a bowl. That's all you need. It's simple, man, doesn't get any easier than that. Smash open the beef. Smash that in the bowl. Two tablespoons of chives. Smash them up. Put it in the bowl. Two tablespoons of basil. Same thing. Dice it up real well in the bowl. Just gonna mince up some garlic cloves. And we're just gonna smash that all together, shove it in the bowl. It's gonna take no time. So we got a quarter of a cup of minced sun-dried tomatoes packed in olive oil. Sun-dried tomatoes, you got the garlic in there, you got the chives, you got the basil. You kind of want it to all be the same consistency because you're gonna pack this all in the meatball uh, together. So you don't want to get like a massive chunk of sun-dried tomato hanging out the side of your meatball, right? Last but not least, we're gonna put the salt and pepper in. So I got Himalayan salt and black pepper, as I said earlier, and just smash that over the top as well too. So here's the fun part where we shove our hands in there and get all dirty and mix it all together and make some little golf sized balls to put on the tray to bake. All right, here we go. Oh, so gooey. Number one. Oh! All right, so now I'm just gonna bring the meatballs over to a pan and I've preheated this. This is about a medium to medium high. I'm gonna get a tablespoon of coconut oil. Put that in the pan, let it melt. So now I'm gonna pour four or five in at a time and just brown them. Not to cook them right through, because we are gonna put them in the oven for about 10 minutes. Now I'm gonna get tin foil, I'm gonna cover that tray and put it in the oven for about seven to 10 minutes and she'll be apples. So just a quick review, I preheated the oven at the beginning before I even started cooking, 375 degrees, and I'm gonna leave those meatballs in there for seven to 10 minutes. Great. What do we have here? You can look at it first. Holy smoke. I'm super excited to give that a go. You got a bunch of meatballs here, have some for dinner, make it for lunch. Like the beauty of recipes like this is that you have enough for the next day. So you prepared for being successful on your next day with food. Now for the tasting. Oh wow. You can really taste the sun-dried tomatoes in these. I'm not messing around because I know every cooking video is gonna be like, wow, that's a, oh my God, this is phenomenal. But sometimes I can be a little bit over the top, but. These are actually really tasty. You don't need any sauce at all. Make sure you give it a go. Let me know in the comments below what you think of it. If you have any other questions, head over to AussieFit.com. Or if you want to join the Aussie Fit crew, make sure you subscribe to our channel. And if you want to check out other healthy recipes, head over to AussieFit.com. That's A-U-S-S-I-E-Fit.com. -S